Welcome everyone, welcome to the show. This here's the show. Let's get the show underway. The masses await. So, looking again at our sun grabber, this thing. This is in Greece, where it would have been like a dome catching the sun and creating a death ray. Up here, melted halfway. I don't want to spend too much time on each photo because we have 88 photos to go through. Okay, this is not Greece anymore. We're gonna jump through. This is a travel channel called Jumping Places. Here, you can see utterly just flooded out. Why would that be like that? But round in the back. A couple of photos. I think I covered this actually, come to think of it. I might be uh, reviewing our last photo there. Same thing goes with this photo here. What are we looking at? Why is it flooded out on the bottom? Doesn't look right to me. Same with all these buildings, the closer you look, kind of just patchwork together, right? These bricks running up everywhere halfway up the wall keeping the building together pasted together like a bubblegum machine why would you build such a thing in the middle of the river like that why you're not protected on all sides you're exposed on all sides Brazil I believe Why would you build a castle wall on 27 degree angle, whatever the hell this is, right? Obviously, tipped over, melted right into the ground, melted right into the side. And thank you to everyone who brought me this photo. I think I found that one on my own. Here's my design. Cabin forward, more of a bubble idea, and then exoskeleton. All right, with the top heavy at the front and smaller wheels at the back, greater turning radius, more stable, lower to the ground. Doesn't this remind you of the White House for some reason? The back door of the White House? I don't know, I just, I'm seeing the White House. What can I, when I, I save this photo, and I'm looking at the White House. I'm like, what? This is exact. And I went, I think I even tried to look it up. Look at this. Think about it, the back door, how it goes down the hill. Swimming pool. Citadella Ottawa time, Ottawa, Ottawa. Mispronounced Ottawa, okay? What's it telling us? Not a whole lot other than just I found it. I found it in the mix. It's going to be in the... It's going to be in the video coming up. All this condensed into one video. It's going to be boots on the ground. I'm working it out with Shepu so that we go and take a little walk on my dog. We can go out the, this way, out my lane, or go out to Baseline Road. You're going to see this formation here exactly what i'm pointing at what you're seeing here uh starfort formation and i could say i guess ancient starfort because it goes back as far as we can find this is the, what is buried what is actually melted <clears throat> in a lot of cases and you're gonna see the outline of the starfort when we walk the path right over here and these uh, little canals or creeks that they have the water running around in perfect formation using Tesla valves, like I was describing many times before, to speed the water up in and here using elevation and bringing that water to laser point to push the water further down, get it towards the river, wherever it is they want the, that to go. All right, so you see these little canals there. Uh, 
And that's where we find ourselves. I'm going to bring conclusive evidence here. What are they saying about Ottawa? I guess maybe there's a reservoir. Looks to be some sort of fence around it. Maybe it wasn't finished when they did this. It is on the books as Ottawa. Misspelling pronouncement maybe, or perhaps the real, the real name of Ottawa is Ottawa. So I'm not sure. I'm just a student, autodidactic student, okay? And, uh, but I'm sure this is what the real world would have looked like before the great X Factor event or the meltage moment, okay? In our melted reality, you find me, okay? So this was one of the closer uh, maps I could find that I could sort of draw your attention to the Ottawa phenomenon. The river, and on both sides of the river, <clears throat> but different heights and elevations. Going in a star, you're going to see it. I should just shut up now. Now, all right. Buried doorways, whatnot. What's the point of that down here then? Right? Right? You find it everywhere. The old paintings are a good way to go. It's kind of melted, or sorry, flooded out in this case. You'd expect to see more stairs on that. Okay. See in the etching. Super precise <clears throat> because you can get the scratch, you scratch the plate. And uh, the little silver plate you can get super fine, like with a razor, okay? <clears throat> then you wash the plate in a, in a uh, ink, like just soak it with ink, wipe all the extra ink off. Then you put the plate against the piece of paper, and then you run a heavy weight over it printmaking you have this etching black and white it's a visual show this time right all right let's move on here's sort of what i'm saying ottawa is and i think that's why oh this is plymouth modeled after plymouth okay so just try and remember that shape because i'm going to be coming back to it and definitely we're going to see all of this in ottawa starfort 3.0 although they call this Antwerp. Same, it's the same design. Looking very much like Ottawa. We saw Shepu covering the fact that they were taking the wall out underneath the bridge and he was shooting from the Quebec side. Okay, so this is what it used to look like. Whew. I'm giving you all the evidence before I actually give it to you because I'm going to have to go over this again because it's a majority of what my, uh, my research is falling into. These tiny little triangles, okay? It's going to come up. It's going to come up. We're going to have to come up with words for this and especially those, the Starfort angle that comes at you super sharp like this and um, you'll see that sometimes coming from the top They'll have these really sharp angles, like uh, not so drawn out, like a fleur de lis angle, like that. So, um, some of the images I've been looking at Citadel Ville, the Ville Citadel. See, so uh, these, these buildings would have remained and they would have taken the wall out and flattened it all out because the, the, most of it was melted I guess you could say Whew. all right you guys what are we at 10 minute mark cheers everybody thanks for joining me on the iReal Media show jumping back to Greece is it yeah okay so they're kind of in sort of no in a bit of a jumbled uh, order here but what are we looking at down here at the bottom Dang. See what I see? You know what I know. <clears throat> Perfect at the top because they rebuilt it probably. Or uh, repointed it between the bricks. 
But down here, there's no fix in that. I'm surprised you can't still see the door frame in that. All right, let's move on. Whoosh. Here's more grease. They're still holding it up from the inside. Here's the turret idea. Citadel idea. So it's hollow. Is that what you're telling me? Look at the, actually look at it from my point of view again. So it's building or not? We're not sure. Look at the floor. Look at the ground. All right. <clears throat> this could be true. They may be the whole North America got taken out and they didn't know if anyone was alive there. So they had to go back and see the actual shape of the land and make sure everyone was alive, perhaps. But looking at the Arctic, Arctic at the top, what do you notice? It's a star shape. Right? Somewhat interrupted on the down on this side, down here, but pretty much a star shape, I bet you. <laughs> Antarctic, probably the same thing going on there. Star shape, right? Some of the older maps, uh, Terra de Gesso, Japan. Looking like it's pretty close to South America there. Africa. The Nubian Desert. The Barbary. Do, 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 do. Barbara. Tartary. Notice all the words are Tuni, Tunis, Tangier, Tartar. Also had the T's in their name, like Trump. Uh, built into the side of a cliff. Bang to the bang, the bang, the bang. You never know what you find in the side of a cliff. Hey, why would you build there? Because, uh, reasons. It's probably like you go right into the hollow. The hollowness of it all. Okay, what happened here then? Rosalind Castle. Here, I think I'm going in, swooping in. This looks like Edinburgh, but it's not, isn't it? Is it? I don't know. 14 minutes, eh? Wow, I got it. Whoa, look at that. I'm gonna try and wrap it up. Maybe what I can do is just take out all the pauses in between my voice like those other guys. Speed it up. You actually only save about five seconds doing that. You know that? Anyway, depends on how long the video is. More looking at stuff. What is it? Uh, Castle. Okay. Do, 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 do. More liquidated castles. The tour of the castles. You can see where I found it up there, Valentine James, excuse me, James Valentine, photographer, melted fences, you see that in Ottawa. Now, there's a tour that they were giving in the Bahamas, here they are, there's the cave opening with 22 on there, they have it kind of you know, whatever, but you sit on a cart and you go down, it's pretty flat over here. They got lights up. Water flowing in every direction there. These are all screenshots from their uh, show. Do, 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 do. Okay, they got little carts. Little buggies going down through the cave tunnel. Perfectly square. Oh, yeah. Did you see that? Oh, it looks like a window. A couple of windows there. Woo. Squared off. More cave action. All right. Cambodia. Just looking at the temple from the travel show. 
get in there. All right, and this one, Tartarian Round Hole, Cambodia, with the red brick and but it scorched out. Cool looking though. Notice the windows. Whatever these round things are, man. Cambodian uh, temples all scorched out. 16 minutes, but I think I had a minute off the top, so I got to hurry up and uh, finish. Bam, look what they're showing us. There it is, the Sphinx. Remember this? Recapping in case you guys missed this one. Bizarro. I put this on my live channel when I was doing a live show one time. Bizarre, look how close that is. It's just close, man. It's the same image. All right, I think that's the show. Y'all take care now. Bye.